Dirty four. All right, we are almost in Algonquin. And this is the first time I've got the video on, so yeah, we have brownies. a lot of stuff. Oh, yeah. <laughs> um, but brownies on the bus. Andrew's got the wheel. So, yeah, wish us good fortune because we're going to need it. Brownies. <laughs> brownies, yeah. Yes. Erica's Bakery. Yeah, just stopped off there. Oh, yeah. We're here. <laughs> we made yep. it. Yep. Love it. Opiongo Lake. <laughs> yeah. Two fifty Yamaha on the back. Just like that. That's it. That was amazing. <laughs> there we go. Just starting out on the uh, twenty-one thirty something or whatever. Portage from Opiongo to Happy Isle. Portage looks pretty good right now. So we're headed back for round two of the pain. I'm not carrying anything right now. <sighs> Piggybacking. Type B. Type B. Kind of fun. This is what we do. <laughs> All right. Portaging is done, and we are on Happy Isle. You guys got some firewood or what? It is it's showing cloudy with rain, 66% chance, uh, six millimeters, uh, high of 28, low of 21. So that's good. Yeah, it's looking pretty good. Great. I think that's. Steak bites and potatoes. Well, it's eight o'clock and we're finally sitting for supper. Eight o'clock? Yep. We got the steak bites on the, cooked over the fire and the veggie packs. And we're all literally just sat down for the first time today, aside from the van. What you got going on, Andrew? Some uh, backcountry coffee. I'm the backcountry coffee barista tonight. <laughs> what do you got? Coffee meat uh, with a vanilla flavor for the cream. A little bit of sugar. Tim Hortons coffee. Oh, Tim Hortons. the press. Um, French press. Boiling the coffee, not just the water. The boiled coffee and the water. Pressing it and adding the ingredients and <laughs> there we go. Sweet. Sunday morning. It's just after eight now. I slept okay. I was awake at 4.30 and never went back to sleep. Mitch said he slept well. I slept great. Andrew, I think he slept well. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, of course, Owen and... Oh, that was Nicholas? Yeah. Oh, I couldn't figure out who that was. <laughs> so Nicholas uh, goes to the back of the site tonight. <laughs> and then we got the scrambled eggs, bacon, and the English muffins toasting. Nice cooking fire going. Peanut butter, jam. Oh, yeah. Well. This is so good. Eggs. <laughs> nice. <laughs> hey Mitch, what are you doing? Oh, just having some jam with <laughs> <laughs> hey, the 
that's where it's camping right there. <laughs> Gotta so get that pine flavor in there. Yeah. All right, we are on the water. Nice view. Portage number two of day two. Hello. Mitch and I are piggybacking. So we are at the beginning of the end. We're having chicken wraps with hummus and red peppers at the beginning of the 800 meter, 1800 meter portage. What do you think so far, guys? Oh, the portage? It's tough. Yeah, it's so tough. It's good. Tough portages. Mm hmm. So, uh, uh, cooking with Mitch. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, is everybody else one? Well, guys, would you do it again? And Give me a break and. Uh, uh, in a couple of days, sure. Yeah. <laughs> Good night's Good sleep. Yeah. yeah. So, this should be fun. Sweet. Done the portage, now we're in the creek. We're up the creek, but we have paddles though. Day two, still. <laughs> uh, last portage of the day. So after this portage is done, that's 10,500 meters today. Andrew and I were just saying how technically, technical and physically demanding that these portages are compared to previous trips. Yep. Wood gathering. Would you guys take that whole tree down? Yeah. Good fire tonight. Yeah. So Nicholas chose to set up here. And when I turn around, this is his view. <laughs> that is why we come here. That's the fire pit down there. And if you walk up the site, make a right, there's a grassy knoll, which is where Mitch is spending the evening. That's Mitch's view. Making pizzas. Yep. It's pizza night. Oh yeah, you're loading the bad boys up. Yum. Day three breakfast. We're Monday morning. So good. Yeah. Cheese and the eggs. Getting ready to hit Otter Slide Creek up to Big Trail. End of our first portage for day three. Well, we are on Otter Slide Creek after the second portage. The guys are just situating themselves there. And this is a sandy, pebbly bottom. What do you think of this, boy? So cool. Yeah. Like butter. <laughs> <laughs> All right, go ahead, Mitch. We are very much windbound right now. We got out of Otter Slide Creek and uh, <laughs> it was like the amazing race. We were racing these people and because we put in a lot of effort over the last couple of days to get to this lake, uh, Big Trout Lake. 
and this is the lake that we're on for two nights and uh, we're windbound we kind of got blown here pretty sketchy <laughs> but it's not the ideal site really because we're expecting rain tomorrow and we want to set up tarps and stuff like that so we're just kind of lounging around and waiting for hopefully the wind to die down What's the good word on the street? Uh, good word on the street is well, kind of myself the, <laughs> the comfy camping uh, couch. Of course you did. <laughs> the comfy and camping couch. Fit right in. There's an armrest here and one there. <laughs> More comfortable than home? Yeah. <laughs> I don't even know what to s What is it? Yeah, thanks. Pasta with some lovely meat sauce with mushrooms, onions, um, peppers, and uh, it's looking pretty good. You can't even compare this to freeze dried. Miles. In the rain, Thank cooking you. pancakes <laughs> on a fire in the rain. <laughs> Thunderstorms last night. Nicholas slept through it. I don't know how. <laughs> but it's a good thing we set up Tent City. Thinking about my bike. Yeah. How's that? So good. How's that, Nicholas? Excellent. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Best bacon I've ever had. <laughs> Nice. Far. Awesome. <laughs> Not even look at that. On by. <laughs> more young girls like carrying them. like I think I seen one of them who's carrying one of those big heavy canoes that has to be like seventy pounds probably. Wow. Like that's yeah. Like that's only thirty. Yeah. That site over there is where we landed yesterday and got windbound and we came from over there somewhere but if I turn you around here I'm gonna come into the camp proper but yeah this is camp got a table fire pit Benches. And up at the top of the hill is our tent city. So that's the site tour. That was our home for two nights. Look at these guys. There's enough wood here for a week. We have a good fire tonight, boys. Mm -hmm. Thanks for doing that. Mm -hmm. no oh, Whoa. put your hands out a little bit more. More, 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 more. Keep going. There you go. And just balance it. You'll be fine. There he goes. Go. Nice. Good job. <laughs> That's awesome. Huh. <laughs> Look at that. Nice job, buddy. Sure. Yeah, you want to come in. Taco Tuesday. <laughs> oh, it is Tuesday. Yeah. Wow. Did we plan that? 
I feel like you did. <laughs> Got two chocolate chip cookies instead of graham cracker, <laughs> chocolate, and a nicely toasted oh, marshmallow. Yeah. All right. Let's dig in. And? Get the string pull. Oh, wow. <laughs> Is that good? That's yeah. great. That looks so good. morning and what a beautiful morning it is here on big trout a difference a day makes all right we're officially on the water 740 so we packed up camp we had tarps this time and everything we're uh definitely into the groove of things now Shore over there you mean yeah yeah because it's like the shore and then the trees and then the trees on the bottom because it's a like glass. Yeah. Are you filming me? I knew you were filming me. <laughs> Whoa. Uh, is that why you're filming? No. <laughs> <laughs> Our first true pull over. So after this portage, we're gonna be on Merchant. Actually, you might be able to get in there. Yeah. On that. Oh, oh, sweet. Oh, we're gonna be there early. Yeah, that's all yeah, brown. Yeah. I smell sage or sagey something. Yeah, maybe. Peter, I just have to pull it out. It died. Get too much blood. Oh, it's an 1840 from Big Trout to Merchant. I think I'll put it back on. Uh, Let's wait. Yes. We came in from that way. Yeah, Done. Yeah. Good job, guys. Andrew's got a fish here. Oh, we... it's a trout. Yeah. Oh, look at that. It's a the laker. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, fantastic. That's a big one. Oh, man. Yeah. Oh, 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 there it is. Yes. Oh. Hey. Oh, <laughs> Whoa. Yes. And my line broke just as he hopped Just in, in time. <laughs> oh. Are you kidding me right now? Fantastic. <laughs> nice job, Andrew. The size, the shape of those minnows reminds me of a fishing lure. Yeah. Bones? It does. Like a little yeah. bone. You can get in the groove. The old What? Try to make. All right, Andrew's got first dibs. Cocas. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh yeah, it's really good. Oh, that's so good. Yeah. <laughs> mm -hmm. Nice and fresh. Okay. Mm. That's good. Mm. Fresh trout literally that's caught, amazing. what, an hour ago? Yeah, yep. probably. Yeah. That trout is so good. Oh man, and look where we're eating it too. What you got there, buddy? Snake skin. Okay, so tonight, Wednesday night, we have Thanksgiving dinner. Chickens in cooking with the gravy. Carrots are boiling. This is gonna be for stuffing. This is gonna be for potatoes. Thanksgiving dinner in the back country. So good. I love it.
Guys. Great. Excellent. <laughs> so up. Excellent. What was that again? It's so good. So this is camp. This is the fire pit. This is Andrew's tent. That's our tent. This is Mitch's and Nicholas's tent. I went to take a picture and it was like drunk <laughs> flames. Yeah, I know. <laughs> <laughs> Andrew's eight foot marshmallow stick. <laughs> like next week that the the fire pit needs cleaned up. Oh, yeah. <laughs> what? We just cleaned that out. Oh, well, it's morning. Day six. How'd you guys sleep? Good. Good. Yeah. Okay, Good. Excellent. Andrew? Yeah, it was chilly eh, last night. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Good mm -hmm. We're on the water. Gorgeous day. Blue skies, not a cloud in the sky. We are on the 3 345 from Merchant to Happy Isle. Start the day off. A little warm up portage. Okay, bud, do the echo. Three, two, one, drop in. Oh. <clears throat> Baby loons. They can do the portage faster than us. <laughs> wow. wow. That was, that was nope. That's a first for me. Great job, guys. Way through the mud, yeah. How was that for terrain? That that bridge was a little bit scary. Yeah. <laughs> Which has got the soup assembly line going on here. <laughs> Made it to our final campsite, night six. It's our last night for tent setups. It's not a very big site, it just goes to there. And then that's our view. We're having food bags tonight. Three yeah. cheese, mac and cheese. Eating a whole pot. And uh, Mitch asked the question, what was your highlight? So let's go around the table. Let's have a fireside chat. Go around the table. <laughs> and uh, around the fire. one highlight and one low light. Okay. From everyone, we're going to start with Owen. All right, buddy, one highlight of the trip for you. Something you remember the most and was the most fun? Doing the portages and seeing how we get stronger. What was a low light? Not getting the fish in the boat. Oh, tell that story. I cast it out. You let a bunch of line out. Oh, yeah. I got a trout right where the edge of the canoe is. You let go Ooh. of the lure. Ooh, it was a beautiful trout, too. Like that big. Yeah. Highlight for the trip was me. It's got to be paddling through those 
little um, uh, creeks and otter slide, going out of otter slide into big trout. Mm -hmm. And a low light was doing the three killer portages the day before through like just a bog and a swamp. Oh yeah. And it just, it really brought my spirits down. But once we got out to the lake, it just made me feel so much better. Awesome. Yeah. Sorry, Mitch. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, me, I gotta say the food. I've been eating a lot. <laughs> that was your highlight? And, but like specifically, it was just like how much I enjoyed the food, you know, bring, even though the weight might have been a downside, carrying those 50 pound barrels through those portages, but it was so worth it when you got to like sit down, we could have our homemade pizzas, our spaghetti with meat sauce. Um, what else did we have that was great? Tacos. Our, our, our tacos, our like full turkey dinner, our chicken <laughs> dinner. And enjoy all that and have home cooked meals with like a great view. I guess the low light <laughs> when, we, when we did that big portage and uh, we had to sit with all those mosquitoes around me biting me and I was pulling off chunks of whatever flies Chunky. and mosquitoes out of my hair but completing it was very rewarding so my highlight was being on a trip for seven days um and you get to experience all the weather patterns um get connected to the wilderness and just be there there's just so much peace in that that is a huge highlight for me and being on big trout <laughs> just cool. in the middle it's awesome being on big trout lake on the first night after the crazy wind uh being windbound and then being on that site and just sitting on that rock watching the sunset everything just kind of passed through and all the wind died down and just just peace overcomes you so yeah huge highlight for me for that and a little late was that 1800 meter kick in the butt portage through that swamp <laughs> mosquito infested insanity on the way to otter slide was it on the way to Otter Slide? Yeah, it was on the way to Otter Slide. Yeah. yeah, that was the same with me. Yeah, that was insane. That was tough. So, yeah, this was a full 100% double carry trip. So that just makes it 1,800 turns into times three. So, like Mitch said, when you're done, it's rewarding. So, yeah, there was just so much. Uh, you know, where do you, where do I even start? Like. The, um, uh, the wildlife, uh, like those, the baby cranes at the crane rookery, um, the, the, um, the, the baby loons, mm -hmm. uh, and watching them literally learning to, uh, to fish and fly, um, you know, all that stuff, um, the amazing race. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> even getting windbound was like a kind of a you know is a, a kind of scary experience but um you know when it's over you're um you're kind of humbled and and uh yeah you're, you're feeling good and then but uh i think the my obviously my highlight was catching the the trout that was uh, amazing but yeah there was just the food um everything was just it was just perfect um but i think my low light would probably would be the um just the you know where the, the portage is with that much weight and that much distance bring you to it, it's just um but that, then again like you guys said like once you're done and you get out to the lake and it, it's behind you that and then you feel so much better but um 
Yeah, all of it. I would do it all over again in a heartbeat. We did a massive trip this year, way bigger than we thought it was going to be. Total amount of portaging, including the one we haven't done yet tomorrow. So, total, we just calculated it'd be, it'd be in meters, it'd be 37,833 meters. So, almost <laughs> 38 kilometers. Portaging. Just portaging. We have no paddling. idea how much paddling we did yet. Um, okay, guys, so how many K of paddling? did we do on this paddling trip well we only did 28k of paddling for the whole seven days so we did 38k of portaging and 28k of paddling so more walking than paddling on a canoe trip we're fit mm. and again that's because we double carried every single portage Okay, so our favorite uh, fire pit was Merchant. Merchant. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was huge. What? Five feet, 15 maybe? foot flame. Yeah. yeah. Oh, it was more than five feet. It was. Yeah, that was killer. Ten foot, maybe. Yeah. The wood was like the best wood ever. So dry and extremely abundant. And if it's there, you're gonna burn. <laughs> oh yeah. And we sure did. Yeah. Bunch of pyros we are. Our saying is just burn it. Yeah. 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 So great trip, guys. And uh yeah. Can't wait to see what next year brings. But uh Hope so, yeah, this was awesome. Yeah, it was a fantastic yeah. trip. If you had to sum sum this trip up in one word, what would you say, Andrew? Epic. Rewarding. Just fun. Epic. Tough. <laughs> Morning of day seven, six seventeen in the morning, and we are packing up and have some breakfast and hit that portage that we've all been dreaming about last night. They're super handy. Clearing the portage. Nice. We just started the final kick in the pants portage. <laughs> Red Rock Lake back to Opiongo. So yeah, I walk along the trail. Oh, what a nice little bridge. And then it goes up and up and up all the way up to there and then some up to there. Piggybacking this whole portage, the whole group here, so it seems to be working out okay. Yeah. yeah. Oh, yes. Oh, my God. <laughs> no way. Yeah. Thank you. Sweet, sweet, glorious, blue, calm water. Oh, yeah. Woohoo! <laughs> well, any minute now, water taxi will be here. Alright guys. Double patty. <laughs> so good. Mm. 